Hey, hello everybody. This is Oksana Boshenko and I'm here today to introduce you a really incredible woman. And we are here right now in Los Angeles and she flew all the way here to do this interview and she is that serious about meeting someone special. So this girl, she is absolutely like incredible blend of beautiful things. Beauty, grace, very smart. I mean, where are you going to find all that? So let me introduce you to Sophie. Sophie, how are you doing today? I'm doing well, thank you. You're doing great, doing great. So uh, can you tell me a little bit about yourself? Where are you originally from? Well, originally I'm from Kazakhstan. From the same country as I am. That's why it's so gorgeous. You're beautiful. Women in Kazakhstan are the most wonderful, I swear. I swear. <laughs> That's what you hear all the time. Yeah. Our girls are amazing. Yeah. So you um you you lived in the United States for a few years, right? You live where do you live? Right now at the moment I live in New York. In Florida. Yeah, you're so soft soft spoken and so graceful and so calm and so balanced. With an incredible smile. With an incredible smile. Yeah. So can you tell me a little bit about your uh, about your life? Uh, have you been married before? No. You never been married? No. How come? How did that happen? I need to take my time. To find the right person. And yes. That's very important. Okay, so you feel that you are ready now for the right person? I am ready. You are ready. That's wonderful. Um, so you are young, you are beautiful. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about the industry? What, what do you do for a living? For a living, I work at the caring company at the moment. In New York? In New York. Mm -hmm. in hospitality business for sales. Yes. And uh, my second job is a uh, personal assistant. Mm -hmm. Why did you like? <laughs> why did you pick the industry of catering? Catering. Um, it just happened that I started working at the restaurant and little by little, I just I don't know how it just became. To me. You know, I uh, I had uh, some time to spend with you, and my personal observation is that you are a very caring person just by yourself, the way you are. You just observing you how you are trying to step in and help, and you know, be uh, uh, being available for anybody who needs the help. You know, so this is this is the type of person that you are. So would you say that in a relationship? you um, would want to take care of your man as well. Absolutely. I mean, I like to do that. I like to take care of my loved ones, my family. Uh, and in a relationship uh, with, you know, with a man, how would you take care of him? So what would you do for him? Well, I would probably spoil him a little bit. <laughs> oh my gosh, you would, wouldn't you? <laughs> Well, you know, in a decent way, okay? <laughs> Not too much, but I'll, so, I'll keep the balance. How do you like to show your hair? I would cook for him. So you're like, a good cook? I am. I used to cook a lot in my country. It was actually, my mom taught me everything from the scratch. That's wonderful. Okay. Um, massages. <laughs> do you know how to do massage? I do know. <laughs> you do? <laughs> Yeah, man, they, they like to be... Are you an affectionate person? Do you like to be touched? Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> I do. Every, uh, right now, I think everybody that, that person who is watching and that I'm touched is like, oh, I want that as well. So you're an affectionate person. Yeah? So kisses, hugs, uh, you know, being close to someone. Does that describe you? Yes. To be close to somebody, it's very important. It, I get to see and I feel the person, mm -hmm. and you know that energy we exchange. Yes, I always try to be positive. Like that's my mentality right now. Positive. Uh, what are your hobbies? Your interests? What are you into besides uh, working 20 hours a day? What else? Do you do? <laughs> well, I try to invest in myself. Like I do learn a lot. I like to. Read. You okay. like to read? What do you like to read? Some science magazine books. Wow! Science! <laughs> Everything that involves with the brain and how our mind works. 
with the body and our soul. That's interesting. Wow. It's, it's an amazing subject. Like if you you know get uh, to that point where you understand how it works, it's really easy. Wow. Why well, what do you think this uh, this uh, this subject interests you? I don't know. I just get excited like knowing how people react in some situations, yeah. how they can stay calm yeah. and you know clear mind. All right. Um, so tell me about your ideal relationship that you see for yourself. So that lucky man who is looking at you right now. How do you see that relationship uh, dynamics, family? Where do you see yourself living? Are you, would you prefer to meet somebody in New York or do you mind relocating to a different place? Would it be a problem to move somewhere in a different place? I don't think so. I think it's uh, when I meet that person. It wouldn't even matter where to live, in what part of state, in, in, in general. I really want to Kazakhstan. Kazakhstan. Okay, so for you it doesn't matter where he is. You're just uh, looking for the right person yeah. in your life. Okay, so then you that means that you could uh, move to like different states in the United States anywhere for the right person. Do you more like big city life or do you prefer calmer places? That's very interesting because I like both. I really enjoy nature, going out, mm -hmm. and I like New York. Okay, so if your man is looking at you right now and he knows that you are the one for him and he lives in a countryside not in a big city and you have that amazing connection with him and perfect chemistry would you move in the countryside for that person you would yeah you would okay awesome all right now uh do you want to uh have a full family like with children and you want to have kids you don't have any children yet right so you would like to have how many maybe two <laughs> two okay all right that's it <laughs> uh if a man has a child already mm -hmm. How big of a problem that is for you? Who has a child? I think it wouldn't be a problem because there's always a way to uh, to find a way to the kid that we can actually be a part of to become. Yeah. So now you have a possibility to give more love and care to two people, not just one, right? <laughs> Well, you are a really, really amazing person and there will be a, uh, a very lucky man. So a very lucky man to have a girl like you. So uh, here is the, uh, you can contact uh, Sophie's matchmaker, Madina. She is working with her personally. So if you are interested in getting to know this fabulous girl, which I know we will find her partner very, very quickly because she is a gem. Okay, so she is that diamond. This is, she is like a rare, rare. Yes, yes, that's what you are. Yeah. So um, if you um, if you're interested in getting to know Sophie, right below this video there is a contact details of a personal matchmaker, her personal matchmaker, Madina, who is going to be working with her. So let her know of your interest, um, and so she can get you guys introduced. Couple of words before. To that for that special person? Well, for that special man, if you are looking at me right now and you feel the warmth in your heart, just let me know. Thank you, Sophie. Thank you. Someone absolutely will be a very, very lucky man to have you. Absolutely. You are fabulous, fabulous, fabulous girl. <laughs> All right. So, I know I'm smoothing you.